And the best of luck with that. <laughs> what, why? Why? What, why? Why are you wearing that? Well, you see, I'm an athlete. <laughs> no, no, I'm an athlete, and I am going to be part of the 2010 Commonwealth Games Queen's Baton Relay. Is that, a, well, thank is that a baton on your hand, or are you just pleased to see us? It's a baton. It's <laughs> <laughs> normally called a baton. Oh, a baton. Tell, tell us Actually, a, a little bit about it. Actually, this baton is actually quite it. amazing, because every country it goes to yeah. is going to go to 70 countries, 70 <laughs> nations. Uh, these colours change. So, obviously, we're in England at the moment, so it's red and white right. at the moment. Oh. So, it'll change. It goes to Wales after... Tomorrow it goes to Twickenham for the England-Australia game. Yeah. Then it's going to go to Wales, so then it will change to... Better get this right. Red, white and green. Uh -huh. Of the world's colours. Does it have leopard print colours? Because Jane McDonald <laughs> it's is going to be taking part in yeah. this, isn't it, she? If you'd like I to think, hand Jane the I baton... I think it'll match with your outfit. It, it does match with your outfit. Well, be oh, careful, Jane. Oh, it's a big one, isn't it? No, Jane. <laughs> I've been sold that a lot, love. Yes, I bet you have. Would you, you, would, you like, would, you like to, would you like to tell Jane what she's going to do? Because you're going yes. to be meeting Mark Lewis Francis All outside right, the building. Yes. I've got to run now. And hand time. on the baton. Hand on the baton. Actually, I think, I think we should do a proper relay takeover. Oh, really. oh right. Oh, yes. Okay. Hand behind you. Okay. Oh, on your marks. <laughs> go, 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 go. Baton. She yes. does. She, now she's going to meet Mark Lewis Francis, who's yes. waiting out on the on the south bank. Tell it. Tell us a little bit about what what Jane's taking part in. So the second part is, is that baton's going to travel, like I say, around seventy nations. It's actually going to travel one hundred and seventy thousand kilometres round those nations until it reaches India. She'll be India. very tired. She's going to be very tired. <laughs> it's one of those things. That actually, it's one of those things that you can imagine James Cracknell doing. One of those extreme yeah. one hundred seventy thousand. Yeah. Yeah. He should actually he should actually be carrying the whole journey. I reckon. Yeah. And then it's going to travel twenty thousand kilometres in India until it reaches Delhi for the start of the Commonwealth Games. How so many people involved in this? I don't know. Uh -huh. That's a lot. Oh, yeah. I don't know. We've just added another couple, haven't we? So yeah. probably, probably thousands upon thousands upon thousands. It's a very yeah. important job that Jane's doing, isn't it, really? Absolutely, yeah. She didn't want to drop it, because it, no. it could oh, break very, very easily. And is this a tradition that's, it's, that's it's, gone it's on made, for many that, years? Actual, that actual baton is actually made up of different grains of sand, which are obviously lacquered onto the baton, of all, all the grains of sand in India. That's why the really? colours are the best. Really? All the, the different colours? Yeah. It's actually got a satellite in it, so you can actually follow it on the Commonwealth Games website and follow it where it's going around the Does world. Does that mean Jane won't get lost then? She won't get lost, no. Or if she tries to run off with it, she will get found. She might get lost because oh, really? we'll know yes. where she is, even yes. if she doesn't. Yes. And is it true? Yes. Is it, is it <laughs> true? Is it true that there's a message inside from the Queen? There is. The Queen's message in the top of it, actually. I kept trying to look in there and see if I could see it. Right at the top where there's a glowing light, and her message yeah. is inside. I think you pull it out and you can it'll be read when, when it gets there on the opening evening. Aww. And uh, who will read it? It'll be read out in, in India when the Commonwealth Games actually yes. begin? Yes. Yeah. I'm not sure who reads it out, whether, yeah. it's, whether it's the President of India or it's... But the Queen herself athlete. doesn't have to read it out, that's what I mean. It's, some, it's somebody involved with the Commonwealth one. Games. It's very exciting. I've never actually seen that cookie, before. isn't it? With a little... <laughs> <laughs> so, so, Mark, how long is all this going to take? Oh, from it's, today it's onwards? It's going to take about 320 days. Really? So it's just going to travel and travel and travel, yeah. For 20 days. Well, obviously, we sent our Jane off. Let's see if she has actually managed to meet up with Mark Lewis Francis. <laughs> uh, Jane McDonald, I don't know if you can see... <laughs> <laughs> I've just got my mask on the team. Lovely view. Just under a bit of a stretch. What? 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 Oh, my God. Just hang on. Oh, it's very heavy. I might have to catch me. Oh! Do you Thank have to you. leave so soon? No. Do you have to maybe dinner, a glass of wine? I've got some winter green in my pocket if you'd like so. I think that's an all then. <laughs> He, he, he's, he's going to go to Twickenham tomorrow, um, tomorrow, tomorrow for the England-Australia game. 
So yeah. obviously he's going to go on again to somebody else, we'll hand it to somebody else, and it will end up there tomorrow, uh -huh. like I said, the day after it then be in Wales. And, and is it true that you're one of the most decorated, I suppose is the best way to put it, yeah, um, yeah, so. swimmers that, that yeah. we have? Yeah. Well, I've, been, I've, I've actually been to six Commonwealth Games myself. My first Commonwealth Games was in Edinburgh in 1986. And you won a bronze at that one? I won bronze at that one, and I've won, I won a medal at every Commonwealth Games until oh. the last one in Melbourne where I came fourth. Oh. But there is, but there is a distinct possibility that I might try and make it seven and have a go next year. Will oh, you really? Should. Who knows? You What's should. it now? I don't know. I'll see. I sort of keep myself in shape because I've yeah. been doing lots of um, dancing. I've been doing a bit of dancing, yeah. doing a bit of modelling. I modelled for Braun. Oh. Shavers, so yes, I have to keep myself in shape regardless. So. We, we've nice. seen the pictures, Mark. I think you've got a good uh, career ahead of you as, as a model, even if nothing else works out. It was purely for research, I'll have you know. Uh, uh, good luck with everything. Thank Lovely you to indeed. see you. Lovely Thanks see you to again. Jane for Lovely doing all the running. And thank you to Mark Foster, everyone. Thank you. <laughs> We're hoping she's going to come back again. Uh, it's break time for the final time this uh, Funday Friday. Uh, come back to find out if Jane does make her way back to the studio. And Claire Sweeney will definitely be here as well. See you in a bit.